All right, here we go. This is our test number two. Let me invite some people in the house. Let me check the sound. Test, test, test. All right. All right, let's get it going. This is our exhibition exhibition season. We're uh, less than 48, or a little bit more than 48 hours away from debuting 24 hours a day, seven days a week. If these shows resonate with you, please share. We're going to be on 24 hours a day, seven days a week, beginning at 12.01 Eastern Standard Time on Sunday, 10 one Let me see if I can uh, invite a few people in. Hey, Beverly Castaneda, you're on this program. I'm going to show one of your videos on here. I'm glad to see you back. I'd like to get uh, some more collaborations with you. Hey, Linda Eubanks, thank you for all your work. All right. You know, uh, had a lot of people that have inspired me and kept me going and have motivated me. A lot of times they don't even know it. Uh, this is a short tape uh, when I was trying to get it started. One of the many times I was trying to get this thing going, uh, I asked everybody in the Sology group two, three years ago to, uh, to make a video like this one right here. This is my good friend and a big influence in, in my life, Eugene Samuel Lane. <laughs> Assalamu alaikum. My name is Muhammad Khalil Eugene Samuel Lang. I am from Liverpool, England, UK. And I am Seoul. Isn't that cool? He was the only one. Uh, him and one other person actually did that, and so I, I still have, I uh, still have that, that video. Um, sorry. Yeah. So let's go right into. Uh, Let's go right into a little background music. How's that? Yeah, we're going to kick this thing off on Sunday. 12.01 a.m. Eastern Standard Time. That's 10 o'clock Mountain Standard Time where I'm at. That's about 3 or 4 o'clock in the afternoon down under, and it's early in the morning in Europe. We've got friends all over the world, and I'm going to be going on three times a day for at least 30 minutes. Beginning on Sunday, we're going to continue with our Soul Speak 5Ds. Be providing a platform for other people and other organizations and groups and artists to bring their soul to shine. It's been a long road for six years and there's a lot of people involved with this. Everybody is part of this because in the House of Sology, everybody's invited. If these shows resonate with you, please share. You know, I just want you to know that this is an expression. This whole thing is an expression. It's no different than doing one poem, or one soul speak, or one painting. Everything we do is an expression. It's always a, it's a, it's a, uh, well, it's a combination, a conglomeration of every single soul on the face of the earth. We're going to be bringing you a lot of good programming. We're going to be doing a lot of things no one's ever done. And the first thing we're going to do is go 24 hours a day, seven which is just you and me and the everything. I think maybe we should kick it up a little bit. Hey, you bet you like
we got friends all over the world and uh, we're going to start connecting all the dots right now this is a little tune uh let's see if i can find it yeah this is a little tune that i just uh, wrote a couple of weeks ago it's kind of fun we'll kick it up a little bit tgif thank the gods and goddesses we are it's friday it's freedom <laughs> Get to shine your soul. This all gets too complicated in this ascension. There's not even anything such thing as resurrection or redemption because everything's perfect. Imperfection cannot come from perfection. We all coming from the same place. Trauma central, true and tried. Life slapped us all in the face. But now we awakening, demonstrating esoteric mainstream. Dark night, sacred spirit screams. Killing lies and living dreams. It's not what you think. It's what you always known. Activation, stimulation, etheric simulation, meditation, visualization, instant manifestation. Faith is revealing. Hell yeah, I'm healing. Fears keep falling. Hear the silent angels calling. Galactic downloads, transmissions, channelings, halos highballing. Feel it rising. We got this shift. Get your grace grip, ego strip. Let this mother, you know what, rip. Air, water, fire, and ice, stone cold, blue, perpetual cycle, it's on the level. Don't think twice, balance, ground. Integrate, guard your space, hells to heavens, holiest place. Grinding in the grace, energetic, etheric field, shadows repelled, revealed, spirit, science, seven sealing, arca covenant, divinity dealing, tripping, trilling by the millions. Hope ain't healing, I say hope ain't healing. Got the mojo magical, senses supernatural. Take your hat off to me and you. After all we've been through, we are force fantastical, mystical, masterful, ancient, alchemical, unifying, untraditional. Remembering, culture conventional, comes conditional, revelational, relevolutional, sacred solutional. Orgasmic super sisters, brothers, can you feel me? Mama, can you heal me? World tried to steal me. Love has revealed you to me. Let's see where we're at here. All right. Here's a pretty cool little tune. It's a house, it's a soul speak, done to house music with my good friends, Tarod, uh, Nicole, and Angie Love. Beyond the conspiracies, beyond the abuse, beyond greed, beyond starvation, beyond war, beyond family feuds, beyond divorce, beyond your job, beyond your angry neighbor, beyond the one who's not interested in you, beyond the darkness, beyond the politics, beyond the religion, beyond gender.
feeling that the universe chose me. And that I am everything and that everything is me. There is this alternate reality. You will just be. You're pulled out of the distractions. You're shown only a life of success. Success in self-love. Success in relationships with the people that are in your life. Success in seeing the beauty all around you. Success in knowing that everything works out perfectly. Take that soul. Anything is possible in our reality. We are reality. Red Sea has parted, and I shall walk across. I love your stories, your journey, our journey. One heart. Many experiences being given to us for us to share and feel. No more hiding. No more expectations. No more reason to feel anything but love. No reason to feel anything but gratitude and joy. No longer feeling the need or desire to work through old stagnant energy or experiences. They don't define me. It's a big ride on on that one. Y'all want to see something funny? Y'all want to see something real funny? Check this out. How are you doing? This is Todd Medina from Sology One Studios. This is my very first uh, <laughs> broadcast. And uh, it's a real short one. And uh, the message for today is something you're probably going to hear me say a lot of. And that is that uh, I am soul and so are you. Don't ever underestimate the power of one unique and equal soul, especially yours. Peace. Isn't that kind of funny? That was, uh, see, that was probably in uh, summer of uh, 2015. So that's been, what, two years? We can all come a long way in two years. I'm living proof. And we can accomplish anything. I'm living proof. Anything and all things are possible to those who believe. And the only belief that's worth anything in this universe is the belief in yourself. We're going to bring you a lot of different types of programming. We're going to keep doing the Soul Speaks 5Ds. We're going to be encouraging other people to develop their own shows. We've got some people that are coming aboard that are helping us get this thing started. We've got some people that have been with us that are helping us get this started. And there's so many people to name, I can't even begin to start naming them. But... Uh, this will give you a little idea where we're headed to. What we're headed to is to be running like three minute and six minute segments of everything uh, with live shows spliced in. Let me just repeat, this is the first 24 hour, seven day a week, beginning uh, 12.01 Sunday morning, Eastern Standard Time. 
October the 1st, this coming Sunday. It's going to be the first one of its kind, and we're going to do a lot of things that are going to be first at Sology, as we always have. It doesn't matter if we're not a household name. It doesn't matter because we communicate through the ethers. That's what this whole energy has been about for so long. This segment I'm going to play right here is, is kind of a, a, a little microcosm of what our program is going to be like. Check it out. Got a little something to say about the ascension. I made a decision. I'm bringing my own resurrection. It's my own ass I'm saving. No one going to do for you what you can do for you. To thine own self be true. We just bring you what we're feeling here at Soldier One Studios. No one ain't believing, believing ain't to know. Third eye, top of the head, nothing such as being dead. Stop thinking the world gonna butter your bread. Ascendance, spontaneity. Forget the spit and polish. Time ain't a wannabe, balling hard for individuality. May you think, question, ask. What are the sun, sin and sun? Take off the max, seated, vibrating, sharing, creating, talking one soul nation. Show me another place we got that. Show me another explanation covering every story and station. No deviating, we celebrating, creating, demonstrating truth beyond the lies. It's me, it's Beverly. And today I'm going to talk about frustration and irritability. And in this body of ocean, I feel this tidal wave coming along. And I feel powerless. And I usually just float with the flow. But when I have resistance to things that I feel powerless over, and I realize that there is something for me to discover about myself, and what I realize is that it's me communicating my truth to me, how I communicate that to me. Am I tuned in to what my body is speaking and saying to me? And that it's more than okay, because this is how I become familiar with the things that I've been conditioned to, the things that I'm unconditioning myself from. And I breathe, and then I cry, and I release, and I get angry. <laughs> but I allow myself to feel and embrace this darkness, this chaos, because the old behavior is to stuff it, and to be in denial, and to hide and run, consciously aware of this and I choose not to do that anymore. We're gonna see what we can do with it. That shit's good, right? This is what it's all about, man. It's not about defining anything. It's about uh, it's a vibration, it's a frequency. And the cool thing about the ascension is you just keep adding more frequencies and vibrations into it. That's what it is. It's not like we're taking anything away. You can't take anything away. Creation can't remove anything that it's created. You know? There's more wisdom in that sound and tone than anything I could say or anybody else could say. Confucius, Jesus, Buddha, Lao Tzu, doesn't matter. You know? That's what we are, man. We're this vibration and frequency. That's who we are. You good? You got it? Complete darkness swallowed me whole, broken, beaten, can't take anymore. Body abused, alone, crazy, hiding scars, body parts. Rearranged my child inside, completely gone. I beg for mercy, no more fight. Done, 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 I surrender. Comic hold slowly releases, I lay still, silent. I can feel, help is on its way this time. I died, I came home, I am reborn. From a golden diamond string, her eyes so kind, her heart whole. She descended from the heavens, reaching, pulling a gift from source. She kisses my mouth, she holds out her hand, I take it. 
I'm ready to be free from suffering. I am ready to live. I am ready to heal. I am safe. I am love. I am so I am. It's a beautiful planet. We're a beautiful species. Everybody's got a role here. We don't understand it. It's time to move away from the lower density vibrations. The veil's been lifted. Plenty of light beings, higher energies that we don't understand and can never understand as human beings. But we have a company here on this earth, and we always have, but now that the veil's lifted. A lot more people have seen it. Keep your head up. Keep the faith. Most of all, stay in your own power. Protect it. It's yours. It's the only thing you can own. Brave in the heart, soul hurting no one. Be what you want to be. Stone cold, soul on ice, no more sacrifice. Thunder and lightning, big pun, gave up the advice. Time to bring up the ghetto guard. We got the light and dark living inside of us. Find the best of us, leave the rest of us. Bring it all down till nothing's left of us. But what you came into the world with, the only savior is the savior we are to ourselves. Loving ain't easy, but we owe it to each other. Wishing you peace, power, protection, big love, healing. Cause it's all the same thing, freedom, love, trust, truth, spirit, and the mighty, mighty soul. One. So we're going to be having a, we're going to be having a mix, oops, <laughs> we're going to be having a mix of all this stuff. Uh, we're going to be mixing commentary with uh, music, with art, with dance, whatever people come up with, whatever's coming uh, from the, from the heart space, from the highest intention and unconditional love, whatever includes every single person on the face of the earth. And I don't give a damn who it is because there's a lot of people I've had to integrate with. And I'm not just talking about people I've known, but I'm talking about things and people all, uh, all around the world in our earth realm. You know, we're going to be doing a lot of talking. We're going to be just putting a lot of stuff out there that's never been put out there before. We're creating. That's what we're supposed to be doing. We're all brothers and sisters, every one of us. This isn't religion. This isn't spirituality. This is soulology, which is just me and you. Name me one place on the, on the, on the planet that every single person is invited. You know, they don't want to come. That's, that's okay, but... Uh, you know, all I can say is every single person is welcome here. I don't care what color you are, what country you come from, what religious affiliation you have or non-affiliation, what your sexual preference is, gender, doesn't matter, all that stuff. So we're just going to keep building it and keep going with it. We're going to start 24 hours a day, seven days a week, beginning at 12.01 Eastern Standard Time. I sound like a broken record. <laughs> On Sunday, 10.01. I'm not sure. Uh, oh, no, let me tell you what I got coming up here. We're going to be uh, promoting a lot of people. This is a platform. Anybody that would like to, to uh, check into that idea and, and maybe expand your own expressions. Sology has always been a safe place for people. It's been a place where people can come tell their stories, whether it be about alien abduction or whether it be about ghosts or whether it be about the, the loss of a spouse or whether it be about anything. You know, the truth is the truth is the truth. There is no right or wrong with the truth. It's just the truth. And when you bring your truth out, you're hurting nobody. Nobody. It's a universal law. And I don't know what that was. It just came in here. <laughs> Did y'all see that? <laughs> but there's a lot of, uh, you know, the veil's lifted. And there's a lot of uh, uh, people that are now starting to experience things, you know, enhance skills and abilities. Um, they're starting to see what used to be to the other side. I can tell you today or last night I had an experience with three individuals that uh, by our terms had crossed over. They all came. They've all been part of my journey. Uh, they're all uh, were spouses of very good friends of mine and they all came to support the situation. I can promise you that we have a huge army behind all of us 
but each one of us is a center of the universe and what that means is what we believe is what we receive and uh, it's a very important very important to go within yourself and be honest with yourself don't lie don't make excuses don't blame anything outside of yourself don't even focus on anything outside of yourself because everything really ultimately comes down to what's in yourself Cheryl or Conroy just said I wish an alien would abduct me <laughs> that's another thing we have a little fun here I've got a, a little piece coming up here a little three-minute piece by uh, somebody who I feel very kindred to. Uh, this is a gentleman by the name of Lavelle Zimmerman. He's out of Germany. Uh, he uh, has been a big inspiration to me and many other people. Uh, he's been a, a courageous soul coming out, uh, I don't know, three or four years ago, um, and just talking about his um, connection with the divine, his communication with the divine, and brave enough to state it. Uh, when I came off the streets, he's one of the first people that I recognized and uh, we've uh, kind of developed a relationship over these years, mostly telepathic. But he's part of a group, Lavelle Zimmerman, part of a uh, part of a uh, an artistic group, and I think a, a group of brothers uh, and sisters uh, called Universal Brother Universal Brothers. And you can see them on YouTube, SoundCloud. They just came out with a new CD. We're going to be putting their music out there because it's incredible. Uh, it's a jazzy rap kind of thing. It's it's beautiful music, and it's got a great ascension message. Um, Lavelle Zimmerman, you might want to check him out on Facebook. Uh, Universal Brothers, you might want to check them out. On, they've got a Facebook page. You can also check them out on YouTube and SoundCloud. Here's a, a little piece uh, that they put together that I pulled off of uh, YouTube. There is a level of selfishness that allows you to serve more. <laughs> So, I'll go around the room this time. How do y'all feel about self-love and your connection with other people? I'm gonna, I'm gonna speak from my friendships. Yeah, most of them. And it's not necessary for me. I mean, I think for me, it's not necessary to always correct your friends mm -hmm. to be able to, you know, how, how, how they should treat you, mm -hmm. right? The only thing you can do is to be an example that for them that you love yourself, so others will treat others will treat you the same way how you really, really, really wanted to be treated inside. Um, for me, self-love, um, cultivate that inside yourself. You don't even think about how you treat others after that because if, if you treat yourself that kind, it's automatic when you're talking to other people Absolutely. Or, or around other people. So. It's a tough journey, but you have to take that step first within yourself to be able to understand that much more about you and others at the same time. First, help yourself. Like for example, okay, you have kidney pain, okay? Uh -huh. You wouldn't know go and get water for someone, okay? Uh -huh. <laughs> take care of yourself, okay? If you, if you get yourself on a level that you took care of yourself well, uh -huh. then you can give. It might sound selfish, but it's not for How can you take care of anybody else if you can't take care of yourself? Thank Absolutely. You. There is a level of selfishness that allows you to serve more. There's an in-between time that allows us the ability to take care of ourselves. Like Mash just said, if you don't take care of yourself, you can't take care of anybody else. When we talk about forgiveness and compassion and acceptance and things of that nature earlier, you have to have these essences within yourself first before you can share it with other people. Learn what there is good to love about yourself. Yeah. And accept the things that are bad mm -hmm. and just work on them. Absolutely. And that right there is what you mentioned earlier. If you love yourself, they'll see it. Mm -hmm. You ain't gotta say it. You gotta say it. Just gotta walk in the building. Yep. That's it. Like I told Pam, it's not what we're giving you, it's what you're giving yourself. We're just flicking on the light switch and that's it. We gotta build something that's basically for the community, by the community, and like don't expect nothing back. Give, 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 give. Love, 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 love. I'm taken care of. I got the worries in my head or is this gonna get paid or can I do this? Push it away. You're doing the right thing, the right thing is coming back. It's beautiful. Absolutely, absolutely beautiful. So, once again, give yourselves a round of applause. You 
are the awakening. That's pretty cool. You'll be seeing a lot of Lavelle Zimmerman. You'll be seeing a lot of Universal Brothers. They've got some great music. They've got a great message, and uh, we're going to do everything we can to promote them. I'm not really sure what I got up here next. Let me see. Oh, let's. Uh, <laughs> this is kind of fun. We'll watch this one. Uh, this is an early uh, Sology video to some blues music. Uh, this is how I started before I started doing Soul Speaks, or this was a Soul Speak, I guess. Uh, but this is kind of cool. It's kind of funky. It was about uh, three weeks after we started doing videos out of the studio in our original studio. How you doing? It's Todd Medina, Soldier One Studios on a Sunday afternoon. Check this out. It's a man named R.L. Burnside. American blues pioneer comes from a family of blues musicians. They played the blues, handed down for generations, picking up instruments at two, three, four, five years old. Where did it come from? It came from their ancestors. This is part of how they dealt with their pain and their misery and slavery. You know, when they came to this country, their spirituality was taken away from them. They were given a different religion and a different God, so to speak. Well, you know, after they were freed, for lack of a better word, a lot of them became sharecroppers. And the way they dealt with their life, the misery and the pain and the limitations of their life was through their spirituality. Now, you know, on Sundays, they went to church. We're not going to deny that. But I'll tell you what, on Friday and Saturday night, they used to get together on the old plantations, and they'd get these instruments they'd make out of anything. And they'd start singing and dancing. Yeah. Woo! Yeah. they start shaking the soul's ass. That's spirituality. I'll tell you what, that stuff went deeper for them in that church on Sunday, you know? Here they were worshiping a man-made God. Not that there's not a one power, because you know I believe there is. But they were worship worshiping this man-made religious icon that was given to them by the same people who gave them that good book, the same people who took them away from their homeland, took away their spirituality, and took away their freedom. They enslaved them and then try to save them. My point is, is the music did more to save them and keep them in their roots than anything else. And the same holds true for everybody else because we're all the same. Absolutely. What was enslavement and for my people, the Mexicans, having land taken away and anyone else that's, that's had any type of suffering in their lineage? What is all that? It's the matrix. That's all it is. It's the matrix. It was either Plato or Socrates that said, the more I know, the less I know. So everything is a simple, profound truth. A lot doesn't need to be said. When we look at the matrix, it's the same way. With the matrix, it's anything outside of ourselves, anything that takes us away from the belief that we are divinity. It's very important to remember that the first order of the day is I am soul. You are divinity. We're all gods and goddesses, and we've got to get back in touch with that reality. And when I get out here and I rant and rave about 9-11 and about the lies in history, I'm not a, and I'm attacking the institutions and the states of uh, the, the, this world and the religions, the religious institutions of this world. I'm not trying to turn anybody against anyone, but it's against a thing, and that thing is formed out of this formed and accepted out of this human consciousness and I will call it the matrix and it keeps us from from uh, uh, finding our own divinity that's what it's all about now one way you do that is to get in touch with your soul don't let anyone stand in the way of your dreams don't let anyone stand in the way of your intuitive power if something feels right 
get out there and do it because it'll take you home. Here you go, baby. Yeah. Now, let me show you how I do it. Ready? Woo! Church on Sunday. Soldier style. Make sure you stay in touch with your soul. Wishing you peace, power, protection, and big ass love. This is Todd Medina. Yeah, watching that's kind of funny. <laughs> I remember that. I was My daughter was in the room with me. It was a Sunday morning. Well, it was actually Sunday. I said church on Sunday, Sology style, but it was actually a Sunday. And we got up, and my other daughter was gone. And uh, my daughter was down there, and uh, I said, hey, I want you to be my cameraman. <laughs> and we just wing it. That's what we do at Soul Sology and Sology One Studios. Uh, and I think that's what we do as souls when we're at our best is we just do it in one take, so to speak, metaphorically speaking or not, figuratively or not. Uh, you know, it, we just do it in one take, you know. The first time is always the best time. I remember when I was trying to get my feet wet with phrasing and speaking to music and trying to soul speak to music. I've got a really good friend who is a, a really good rapper uh, in Houston. Uh, he's not known or anything. He just he just has the ability to do it, and uh, he's awesome. And uh, and I was telling him how you know it was coming. He was asking me, and he and I said to him, you know, I, they're all the ones I'm doing are one or two takes. He said, when is there ever a better one? And I agree with that. The only the only time we have, the only moment we have, is the eternal moment that's here and now. Period. Everything else, uh, you know, yesterday can't hurt us, and tomorrow can't help us. Uh, I don't know what I got going up here. Now. Oh, I tell you, let me see what I got here. All right. Now, what we're going to be doing, like I said, is we're going to be promoting other people. There's people that are part of the Soldier team. There's groups and people that are going to be associate, uh, more like associates with us. I consider everybody Soldier, but it's just an energy. It's just a name for the energy that is the universal energy. That's all it is. It's truth. It's love. It's, it's trust. It's freedom. It's spirit. It's soul. It's all the same thing. But one of the people that's uh, going to be coming off the ground with us or getting us off the ground is Sarah Richardson. Uh, you can see her. Uh, I can't remember. <laughs> I can't remember the name of her uh, of her page. She's got a YouTube page, and she's also and I, she'll say it in the video. But she's got a YouTube page and she's got a Facebook page. Sarah Richardson, you might check her out. You'll be seeing a lot of her. We're going to be doing a lot of fun stuff. We're going to be doing a uh, uh, a weekly. Uh, kind of a weekly Ascension newscast with uh, four of us. We're all going to be on the screen together, and we're going to have like a little 10-minute uh, uh, episode of what's going on and that type of thing, and uh, just trying different things. And if anybody has any ideas and wants to collaborate or has anything they'd like for us to put out there, uh, just please uh, send it to soldier1studios at gmail.com. You can message me, but that message uh, box is getting fuller and fuller every day. I'm having a hard time keeping up with it. Uh, this is called Let It Go in Love. Hello, welcome. Always think up, always think up, always think up. So I know we're letting go of attachments. You want to know when I, I know why? Because I'm letting go of my house that I lived in my whole entire childhood, right? Um, through these attachment guys, it's not to hurt you. It's not to test you. It's to make you love yourself more. So if you're going through something right now, and you're feeling all these pushes in your life and it hurts you, please know that it is to bring the best out in you right now. Um, you know, guys, it's been a while since I did a YouTube video, so I love you all. I do. I really do. And even though I'm going through one of the hardest times in my life, letting go of one of the most important things in my life, um, there's love all around me. So there's love all around you, too tap into that love follow that love live that love if you're creating create more if you want to talk to me about it message me private message me here anytime um i love you all and i just want you to know that we're all going through this we're all connected there's a reason for it all trust and believe that um and if you're having a hard time, just do more of what you love. You know, I love nature, so I just did a massage today, had a great lunch, came out to nature to connect. Um, 
I love you guys. And there's something about Mother Earth and Mother Earth will fill you with love. And so, you know, if you're feeling like you don't have love, then you want it from somebody, connect to the mother. She will give it to you. I love you guys. One love. Right on. And see, that's Sology. Sology is here's somebody coming in there and they're and they're just putting it out there and they're just being real and they're saying, hey, I'm having a real difficult time, but I'm still in the game. I'm having a real difficult time with the circumstances in my life and many, many people that are watching this and many people that will watch this and many people that are in the circles that we're all in are all having difficult times in terms of the earth definition of that. They're having a difficult time because they're being put uh, in a universal isolation. They're being forced to find their soul mission. And, uh, and, and it's an incredible journey. We've all seen the energy change over the, the last couple of years. Uh, I want to say go back to about two years ago, November of 2015, when the divine feminine energy really started to be felt. This thing is just escalating and escalating. We're all expanding. Uh, we can do anything. Uh, the way I look at it and what I've received from infinite intelligence for six years is to step away from the 3D. And what that means is you can't use the same behaviors and patterns that we've had in this conditioning of this earth realm and expect to get to 5D. We've got to create, create, create our way out of it. And that's to me what Sology is all about. Sology is about I am soul. And I make the joke a lot, you know, I am soul can also mean I'm not afraid to show my ass. And I think that's what it is. And I think that's what she just did on that video. She just put it out there and, you know, and, and, and it's just a free fall, free fall into the hands of Mother Universe where you have complete faith that you're divinity and we are divinity. There's no, no, there's no other thing. It doesn't matter what you think. It's just the way it is. Now, let me give you an example. Let me give you an example of a collaboration. Now, this goes back to the uh, about a year and a half ago. Uh, when we started doing soul speaks and I was in this very small Facebook group that was doing some kind of uh, deep uh, spiritual historic studies and stuff like that people were talking about their past lives and stuff like that so I went into the group about 50 people and I've shared my I shared a soul speak in there and this lady from uh, Germany she uh, is now a friend of mine Ulrike she saw it and she was a writer and she said i want to do a soul speak i said well just you know spit it into your phone and then i'll take it and i'll put some music to it and uh, so she not only did that she not only did that but she also provided the imagery and i just kind of put it up and i just want to say carolyn uh adam showed up here too <laughs> all right here we go to the words it's very very powerful she actually did this just uh, freestyle to no music hi hello brother hello sister do you think you know who you are do you think you know what you can do i'm telling you you don't know a thing about yourself as long as you think you're limited why am i telling you why am I so fierce at this moment? I'm telling you, I did think I knew who I am. All the time I would be mild and gentle and peaceful and, and humble being and it's perfect to be like this. You know what I mean? It is perfect to be all this. And I tell you, I still am. That's the other part of me, of you, of anybody, of us. Whatever you are practicing all the time, all the years of your life. What you think you're good at, what you should improve and what you should be perfect in. Because you're born with it. I'm telling you, there's much more in each of you. In my case, this, you feel, you hear now, this fierce energy, this fire and this pressure. So much pressure because I've held it back, held it back all my life. What the hell did I do? I'm exploding, my goodness. You see, maybe it's not your part to learn this one, but I'm telling you, don't, don't.
Don't rely on that what you think you are. Don't rely on that what people are mirroring you and telling you what you shall do or be. Just find out. Find out. Just do it. Go on. Try yourself. Make mistakes. Fall and fall and fall again. And get up. Get up. Get up again. You cannot fail. You cannot do anything wrong. Just do it. Do it. Get back your natural energy. Get back your natural being. Your whole natural being. No matter if you're young or old. If you're a man or a woman. No matter which country you've been raised. No matter. No matter whatever people told you you are. No matter whatever ever you thought you will be. Just be serious with yourself. Just be honest with yourself. Feel, feel all the little things that want to come up in you and want to be expressed and lived and felt. Just go, live it, be it. One take. It was one take. Beautiful, beautiful expression, beautiful lady, beautiful soul. What's all this? What's all that? Who is he? Where it's at? What is she? Another smokestack, hard soul impact, talking spirit, street smack, galactic, full track. She's got the angels at her back. Look at her, what you see, another mirror into you and me. Can't you see you is you, me is me? What else can we be? Take my eyes off of you and look at me, now I can see. Supernatural benefactor, illusion detractor's not a factor. I come from the hereafter. Got my natural nature. High vibrational, creation in motion, sexy soul sensational, mama's love potion. Neo-navigational, intuitive, emotional, rational, derational, life's devotion. Fantasy factual, new earth approaching, multi-dimensional, cosmic congruence, re-love solutional. Come on now, I'll raise this roof with you. Blue cobalt skies, violet purple flame, avians, octurians, ancient, akashic, anarchists, andromedans, able-bodied human souls, time to get bold. You've been shown, you've been told, we glory gold, halo homegrown. Shift happens, veil lifted, life is for the gifted, mama universe has shifted, get your grip, let it rip. We walking each other home, only place we ever know. Heart, space, straight soul, what you think ain't what you know. Internal intimacy, masculinity, femininity, divine union is convincing the hell out of me. So it ain't what in you I see or what you see in me. You see me, I see you. That's the road we walking. Enough of this 3D talking. Time to go soul stalking. What your frights? What your fears, what you feeling? Another shift is near. Time to ground, time to balance, time to clear. So what's all this and what's all that? Who is he, where it's at? What is she, another smokestack? Hard soul impact, talking spirit, street smack, galactic full track. She's got the angels at her back. Look at her, what you see? Another mirror into you and me. Can't you see you is you, me is me? What else can we be? 
Take your eyes off of me and look at you. Take my eyes off of you and look at me. Now we both can see. Blue cobalt skies, violet purple flame, avians, arcturians, ancient, akashic, anarchists, andromedans, able-bodied human souls, time to get bold, you've been shown, you've been told, we glory gold, halo, homegrown. Chucky Beats, C-H-U-K-K-I, Beats, B-E-A-T-S, on YouTube. We've used uh, five or six of his songs for our 50 plus soul speaks. We're going to be coming out with some products and some services. They're not really products and services, but those are the human definition. These are going to be activated healing energies. This is the way we're going to try to subsidize, or not try, but this is the way we will subsidize uh, our efforts. We're going to be winding the show down here a little bit. Just remember, we're kicking off. I would highly encourage each and every one of you to come to our, our kickoff, which is at 12.01 Eastern Standard Time. So that would be 11.01 in the Central Time Zone, 10 o'clock and 9 o'clock in the U.S., about 3 or 4 o'clock in the morning, down uh, 3 or 4 o'clock in the afternoon, <clears throat> down under Australia, New Zealand. We have a lot of friends down there. And it'll be early in the morning on Sunday, about 8 o'clock, 7 to 8 o'clock in Europe, where we have a lot of friends, too. We've got friends all over the world. The demographics show it. The biggest market we have or the biggest uh, support we have is in London, actually. <laughs> London, uh, New York, Chicago, Houston, L.A. Uh, Melbourne's real big. That area's big. Sydney's big. Uh, South Africa's real big. We've got people... Uh, from all over the world and you know the numbers aren't always uh, the proof that you know you find in the pudding it's the energy and that's what we have we've got this extremely powerful energy where people can come to a place where they're safe if you watch the soul speak 5ds you'll see we've had a lot of divine feminine energy on there over the last month uh, they can come there they can speak their truth more and more of them are stepping up we've got several on the uh, on the liftoff team like Sarah Richardson um, and, uh, what did I say, Sarah? Yeah, Sarah Richardson <laughs> and Shannon Whitaker. Uh, Nori Love's with us. Uh, we've got a lot of people behind the scenes, too. Jeannie Campbell, Donna DeMeo, Linda Eubanks, Lee Kara. The list goes on and on and on. We've also got some people that we're uh, co-oping with uh, and groups that we're co-oping with. You know, we've got Lavelle Zimmerman, Morgan Lee, their groups, uh, Universal Brothers, Power of Invocation. Uh, and I've got a whole long list of people that I've cultivated relationships uh, with over the last few years. And I've been telling people, <laughs> I've been telling people that we're going to do this for a long time. And, uh, and <laughs> you know, on one hand, you could say that I was uh, just a pipe dreamer uh, because, you know, it just wasn't happening. But uh, I guess we're, it doesn't really matter anymore because today is a special day. Today we've got everything working. We could actually start going 24-7 right now, but I've still got some work to do. Uh, so let me just explain that for those of you who just came in. We're running 24 hours a day, seven days a week. No one has ever done this, not one, but no organization. None, it's never been done. It's never been done before, okay? And it really doesn't matter if it hasn't. But a 24-hour a day video cast with this type of programming, uh, with music, with dance, with art, uh, with commentary, you know, with everybody bringing their truth, bringing their stories, good talk shows, and people developing their own their own connections from you know the groundswell that is the heart space, that is the pure energy that we are, uh, and it's just connecting, activating each other, and that type of thing. I'm excited. I've been real excited all day. There's a lot of powerful energy coming down. Let's just take a take a minute to discuss that. You know. It's it's getting to the point where, you know, I, I, I'll just give an example. I think it was today or yesterday. I had some, uh, no, it was yesterday. I had some close friends that were just telling me, hey, you know, I'm, you know, <laughs> I'm, all, I'm in fetal position. I'm crying. I'm like, hey, I was doing that last week, you know. So uh, this is coming. And the one thing, uh, it's, it's great to have fellowship and it's great to have uh, the support from other people. But one thing about this ascension or whatever you want to call it, 
okay? One thing about it is, is that it always goes back to ourselves. So it's kind of a double-edged sword, reaching out and getting that support, because at the end of the day, as everybody's starting to find out, you just got, even if you're, you know, even, you know, I have to step away uh, from, from my beloved, I have to step away, or she has to step away, or other people that are in relationships, or whatever the case is, have to step away, go into a room, close the door, and get down with the universe, the universe, and that's how this thing rolls. I can, I can tell you something else, too. What I've seen is that these, these energies, when they come in, they're, they're become, if you pay attention, if you, if you can um, rely on your intuition, trust yourself, be honest with yourself, it gets easier and easier. It doesn't take as long to get through it. And when, it gets, and when it's seemingly dark or when you've had enough and been frustrated and you're cussing the universe like I do uh, when things get a little tough, uh, I also start to remember now that this is the sign uh, before things really, really pick up and, and take off. Don't forget, it's all about you and me. It's all about the I am soul. Uh, let's do another fun number. Uh, this is a soul speak I did, I uh, wrote a couple of weeks ago. <laughs> History been revisiting us lately, false flags were faking, now we awakening. We all we got, life is for the taking. Get your soul shaking, faith fast breaking, future past recreating. I am soul means the universe is our PlayStation. Moving from the 3D chakras firing, kundalini centipede unchained, mind broke free, getting back our memories. It's not what we was, it's what we be Hearing wisdom of the elder trees Swimming mama's deep blue seas Flying through our multi-dimensionality Femininity, masculinity, trinity, divinity Infinity, perch, plucked, perpetuating Elevating, illuminating, emancipating Manifesting hell to heaven, creating Normalcy, negating Conformity, constraining Healing shadow pieces, now the pain ceasing. Infinite intelligence increases. She's the highest priestess. He's like her, another rainbow warrior god. God is giving, receiving, conceiving, believing, achieving post apocalyptic, mythic to mystic. Heaven just another blip on the soul highway. Veil lifted, spirit shifted, life is for the gifted. Tomorrow is the past, yesterday's today, Saturday's Monday, Tuesday's Sunday, all the same, human control, time frame game. Space is the place, spaceless etheric interface, gave up the paper chase, caught the holy pace, the real race. It ain't a sprint, it's a magic marathon. Kicking love, smoking angels, trust, galactical, magical, emphatical, elemental, sentient, earth, fire, water, air, soul on ice. Triad, pyramid, pineal, pituitary, DNA, proprietary, soul encoded, death, death is duly noted. Universal promissory, eternal moment, all we have, all we be, creations from our thoughts. Let yourself live, let yourself free. Light grid lifting, light workers shifting, vortex portals, magic mixing, universal life force, whole holy is fixing. Timelines flattening, but we ain't tripping, duality double dipping, heart space skipping to the colors coming down, rhymes are ripping, red, black, white, yellow, brown. Not what we thought, always been what we known. Halo from the hood, homegrown. Serious Andromeda, super sisters, found your Venus crossing Mars. Souls of spaceship, hear your roar, feel your glory, flip the script, choose your timeline, change your story. Perfect imperfection, universal correction, divine direction, intuitive throat chakra inflection. Soul never dies, internal, external reflection, times a misdirection, human soul cross section. 
Never mind the stories of past neglection, reincarnating resurrection, reformation, transformation, holy from the hottest hells, breaking words, casting spell, drinking from the wisdom well. World got nothing but a soft shoe shell. Seen enough of the show that don't tell. Time for the light to raise some hell. 369 knowledge nailed. We all being unveiled. No more lies to tell. Truth abides, it's a fearless trail. This is going to take some practice. Well, we'll get better and better as time goes on. All of us will. And so we're just going to keep coming at and try to represent you as best we can and bring some more people in here because I'm running out of breath. <laughs> if these shows resonate with you, please share. And don't forget to tell your friends and post and share to your groups. We're going to be doing some posting here tonight, tomorrow, and the next day. 12.01 Eastern Standard Time on Sunday, October the 1st. Uh, we're going to make history. We're going to kick off a 24-hour day, seven-day-a-week video cast called Sology. And we're going to be providing a platform, or we are providing a platform for, for whoever. Whoever wants to come in here, as long as that message is coming from the heart space and it has a oneness it has a oneness vibration to it, and that means everybody's included, every single person on the face of the earth. Uh, we'll, we'll take a look at it. It can be a commentary, could be an interview, could be a song, could be a dance, could be some poetry, could be some pictures that I'll put to a video, whatever you want to do. Any collaboration that you'd be uh, interested in doing, uh, please hit me up, soldier1studios at gmail.com, uh, or you can message one of the people that's supporting this situation. We are going to be... Uh, coming out with some products and services like I said we consider them to be divine energetic uh, entities <laughs> uh, everything that we do has an intention uh, and that intention is the highest intention uh, in our unconditional love and gratitude I want to uh, wish everybody peace power protection and big ass love for you and yours tonight have a good weekend don't forget about us uh, 1201 on October the 1st, Eastern Standard Time, we're kicking it off 24-7. I may come back on tonight. I may be on tomorrow a couple times. But beginning Sunday, I will be on three times a day for 30 minutes minimum. And we'll also have plenty of other people coming on live, especially as the weeks progress. One.